Greetings and hallucinations, ladies and lads. I am Chancellor of the Harmonious Frequencies of the Mighty Empire of Onion, and this is RimWorld. Well, we have been doing some stuff. Of course, last time we had to fight off an Ibex attack. They were all maddened manhunters. Uh, but we did so successfully. Minor injuries. So that's good. Of course, there is uh, still quite a bit of building that needs to be done. Therefore, I have decided that we are going to try to go on a construction crunch this episode. And get all that stuff accomplished. Go ahead and haul all of this corn, El Boyo. Because I know what you're doing right now. Go ahead and haul some more of this corn. El Boyo, did you not hear me? I said haul this corn. Koth is cutting blocks. Levin is binging on Psykite. Final straw was hot. Oh, it is 91 degrees, that's right. Yep, we have a lot of naked... Why in the world? Oh, they're all... restricted to the barn. There we go. Okay. That's more like it. Get out there and eat some food, you silly critters. Alboyo is getting the meat out, so we should be able to make some pemmican with the last of this corn here. That'll be good. Some ambrosia has sprouted. Wonderful. 5% grown. Well, I'll have to try to remember that it's up there. Take a look at it later on. A large herd of elephants is passing through. They won't attack unless provoked. Oh, it is a large herd. Holy cow. I was thinking about seeing if we could uh, tame a couple of them, but I'd rather not mess with them. Because if they tried the revenge uh, for trying to be tamed, that would prove disastrous for us. So let's just leave them, leave them be. Let them go on their way. Horn, I'm going to need you to refuel this. I would also appreciate it if you could haul uh, this pemmican where it needs to go. Wonderful. Is it cool in here? 59 degrees. It's not quite refrigerated, I don't think. Delicious. How much medicine are we up to? 36? That's pretty good, I would say. So let's get in here and take a look. Uh, crafting, we do have three, four people on crafting right now. Uh, let's bring down the smithing, bring down the tailoring. So they will work primarily on cutting stones. Construction. We want as many people on that as we can. Handling can come down to a two for the time being. Kagris. Same. Training Wild Boar 18. Okay. This is fine for now, but... Hunting a tortoise? Refuel the stove instead. Where is this tortoise that you're trying to hunt so desperately? Don't. Don't worry about the turtles. Wait a minute. Got shot in the head with a recurve bow? From who? Dweeb. Hit the willow tree with a shot intended for the... Why was Dweeb shooting at the timber wolf in the first place? Oh, because this isn't our timber wolf. This is not our timber wolf. 
We have green and flossy, male and female. She's pregnant. 12 days. Uh, but this is not ours. So it should be hunted, as a matter of fact. Yep, surprise, surprise. Is there anybody close by who could help? Maybe. Please help, Dweeb. It was already shot in the head once. Come on, Dweeb. You can do it. Nice. Well done. And it is dead dead. Wonderful. Uh, medicine skill of three. As much as I want this construction done, I'd rather she get tended to right away. Nose shot off. Right femur shattered. I think I've talked about that before. So yeah, if you know if the prosthetic leg is going to help her uh, walk better. This is something I am interested in uh, remedying. Oh yeah, we're getting these floors laid. Wonderful. To be real too, um, I know it's a huge pain. But this should be all the way around, basically. So that stuff doesn't grow up uh, right along there. Oh yeah, who knew? I knew. Alright, do we go and rest until you're healed? Brandon, you're pretty good. And you are going to rest, so... Go ahead and get the tending done. How are we on medicine? 35? That's not bad. I think only two of them are regular medicines, they are. What are my growers up to, though? Oh, constructing. Horn and Midi are the only two that are dedicated right now. And Horn cooks most of the time. Okay, there are still a few vegetables, and these corn plants are ready to be harvested, so. Oh, man. So, I, uh, I forced Mitty to unwear her forced clothing, and it took off her special hat. So, Mitty, put this headdress back on. She might have successfully recruited human if she had been wearing this at that time. Who knows? Good. Kate Gris is getting the blocks cut. I can hear construction being done. Koth and Brandon. Here goes Mitty again to try and recruit. Oh, are you kidding me? How many of these have we had to deal with so far? I'm so tired of mechanoids. I can't even I can't even tell you how tired I am of them. Okay, let's get this done immediately. It's the right time of the day. Uh Midi, don't worry about it because you are a melee character. Dweeb. Forty three to twenty seven, it's possible. Consciousness is at ninety one. Moving is 44, manipulation 86, sight is okay. Dweeb might be able to help us out here. I'm not entirely convinced, but it's possible. Okay, let's give ourselves a decent amount of range. Hide behind this cover. Kate Gris, uh, take this. Koth, try this. Alboyo. This would be good. Dweeb, you're slow. Uh, so actually, Koth, if you would come in here, then Dweeb, you could come in here and Levin uh, up here, maybe?
Oh, wow. Perfect. Shooting accuracy will be improved for the next three days. We don't need three days, but I will go for what we have available. Dweeb, where are you? Dweeb, where are you? There you There she is. Okay, Halboyo, I would even have you stand here, I believe. Kate Gris. Goth. Maybe this is better. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how cover works exactly. If anybody else knows, feel free to let me know down in the comments. All I know is that if they're standing there, it should protect them from the enemy. Do I know if it does? No, I don't know. Can all of these four concentrate fire on this guy? No. Kate Gris. Fire at this one then. And it's hiding behind this uh, chunk, which is a huge pain. Alboyo is immediately downed. Torso and right lung death in 20 hours. Is this guy coming to melee attack right now? I've never seen them charge in like this. Levin, can you move? I've never seen them charge in like that. What's happening right now? Horn, I need you to come save Alboyo. Midi. Uh, rescue Levin, please. Do we... If you could fire at this guy, that'd be fine. I don't want Levin to get killed by us trying to shoot at this guy. Let's try and take him down. Come on. Come on, guys. Nice. Okay, Dweeb has nobody to shoot at now. Um, come up here and... Okay, Gris. Say maybe you could get a little better shot from here. Dweeb. Go ahead and shoot this. You can do it, Mitty. Bad back. Should be fine. Alboyo's probably perfectly fine, yeah. 19 hours to live. Okay. Whoa. Dweeb. You need to be tended to right now. Go tend to yourself. Brandon, you've got eight hours to live. Already doctoring yourself. Wonderful. 22 hours to live. Go ahead and shoot this. Kate Chris, help him out. Disgusting. It's always a huge problem trying to kill these guys, and it's always frustrating. We get the blades off of them, though, are incredibly valuable, so that's always profitable. That's not something I care about, though. I'd rather my colonists survive. And it's not guaranteed in situations like this. Especially in Brandon's case right now. Okay, Levin's no longer incapable of walking, but how long does he have to live? He's fine. Got 18 hours. Dweeb should end up being okay. Go ahead and rest. Brandon, are you tending to yourself with medicine? You are. Go ahead and rest. Mitty, how about you hang out and tend to these folk? Horn is trying to rest. How much further does this have to go? 
Oh, wow. I just right-clicked on Koth. What happened? Why is it generating the planet from right-clicking on Koth? I didn't realize that was a thing. And why would it be? Major break risk. Are you tending to yourself way out here? With minor blood loss and no medicine? You're a madman. Can confirm. Okay, Kate Gris has knocked out the acquisition of Scyther Blades. Wonderful. Dweeb should end up being fine. Yes, indeed. For certain. Okay, Brandon's no longer incapable of walking. That's good. He was also very close to uh, death. Yep, so Mitty has a forced hat on, but there's nothing that I'm going to do about that right now because I need her to have that hat on. Ibex meat rotted away. That's a shame. We don't have anything else to make food out of. So this is also a shame. We have several people on hunting, so as soon as I set something to be hunted, it will be. Horn is butchering this guy. Gal thing. It's good. Oh, I thought about something a hundred years ago, and uh, this kibble can be made out of more ingredients than what it is. We've got human meat selected, I believe. Okay, I did select insect meat. Good, good. I was thinking about that uh, a couple of days ago. And I thought, well, I best have that selected. Let's cut these down. Okay, this bun. I think these tortoises are eating my crops. Point five percent chance. Ridiculous. Uh, who else was it that went down? Was it Levin? It was. Cutting a cypress tree. Go ahead and grab your bow back. Well, we never did set this down. It says power needed. Not connected to power, but it says power needed zero watts. I don't think that's the case. I think it does need a certain amount of watts. I think it just means that there is power needed and it's connected to zero watts right now. Let's try and install it underneath this roof right here. We'll see how that goes if anybody gets around to it at one point or another in the future. Meditating. Yep. Go ahead and get your joy fulfilled. Dweeb, where are you? Oh, already. Oh, a whole bunch of pemmican. That's wonderful. Let's go try and get that. One turkey. It's fine. We need the meat for a short amount of time. Perfect. Let the food production never stop. I command you. 397 granite blocks and nobody can take the time to complete these two rooms here. 
for some reason. I'm not sure exactly what's... Oh, I see what's going on. Yep. Cancel these. Don't worry about the dang deadfall traps. It's the most useless waste of time right now. If we have structures built, we don't need to worry about the deadfall traps. And if I can build traps all the way across here, I may as well just build a wall all the way across here as well. Um, just close this off, close these off. Maybe put a door in there so that they can walk through. This one will be tough though because I think this is mud here. Yeah. This is soil. I don't think I can close this off right here. I think no matter what I do, they're going to be able to come through. So I'm going to have to build a wall where I can and then put up a bunker uh, so that we can defend from this side. But this should be able to be walled off. This is able to be walled off. Um, this is kind of a long stretch, but we could wall this off pretty well where nobody could get through. This is a very long stretch, and we can't wall this off all the way. Um, we can't build on this marsh. And, oh, I didn't think about that. There's mud right here, too, so I can't build straight across. Man, uh, yeah, swamps certainly make it difficult. This is a mess, too. I really need to undo this and uh, change it all. So that's going to be something that we do um, in the future. Yeah. I'll have them take this stuff down. I'll probably leave the deadfall traps for now unless they uh, get in the way of what I'm trying to do. But we need them to take down the ceilings before they... the ceilings, the roofs, before they dig into the structure. Okay. And I did set people up, right? Yeah. We've got construction at a high priority. Crafting is pretty high priority, so we should be making the materials for what we need to be doing right now. We have a ton of pemmican saved up right now, so that's wonderful. I hear... Oh, okay. So they've decided to forsake everything and just take down ceilings. That's fine. Roofs, I mean. That's perfectly fine. Yeah, there we go. Hopefully they don't take off to do all this immediately, because I would much rather they focus their energy on stuff nearer to the base. There we go. Poor Brandon. Man, he's been down for a while after that attack. Nearly lost his arm, it looks like. Fourteen tribal headdresses for 1,100 silver. Fourteen days this lasts. It takes six and a half to get there. 6.2 if we go around this way. 12.6 round trip. Fourteen headdresses, they said. Oh, I'm pretty sure that's what it said. Yeah, 14. We can try it. 14 days. So we'd have to be able to make them in less than 5 days so that we could make it up there in time. Let's do 7 here. Like that. We'll see who gets on it because I don't have tailoring set up very high. Uh, we could. We could. Let's do it like that. Oh, wow. This floor is almost done. Wonderful. This floor is done. Wonderful. 
cost floor is almost done. We've gotten several poor beds. Awful. This is terrible. Yeah, we don't have anyone that's great at crafting besides Kate Gris. Um, oh, but building beds is construction, isn't it? That's not crafting. I was totally off on that one. Levin, how do you not have an actual bed? Is it because of this? Because these structures just can't be built for some reason? We have the materials. Brandon, I command you. You're trying to go relax, but this is not acceptable. These rooms should have been built ages ago. Koth, I don't care what you're doing. Work on these walls. Both of these buildings need to be built already. Okay. They're still on it. They're still on it. Wonderful. Nobody's using this, so this will be Levin's then. So we don't need beds in here anymore. Wonderful. Surrounding. Good, good. We've gotten at least two done. Two left. Yeah, Kate Gris is really knocking it out. Beautiful. Very well done. We'll be able to send out the caravan for this, maybe this episode. Have any of these been made? No, not yet. Soon, though, I'm sure. Yep, build complete. Why is there amniotic fluid in my uh, kitchen, I wonder? Alright, wonderful. Uh, now he should be able to haul corn inside. And Mitty, I wouldn't mind if you would give him a hand with another stack. Now let's get the heel root planted, actually. Horn, you yourself can uh, hold this elsewhere. Well done. Okay, it may not be this episode that we're able to send out the uh, caravan with the headdresses, but they should be they should be built in time that we send it out in time. Yeah, there's seven so far. And it's only taken a day to do that. Who is it? Oh, Brandon. Well done. Levin is on top of it too. Construction failed. Like a total noob. This is good though. This is great. 
uh, for them to be constructing. There's a good bed. Excellent. Good. 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 Awful. Normal. Awful. Good. Good. Okay. Excellent. Superior. Okay. Infirmary is still looking terrible. We've got a normal bed there. A normal one there. A poor one. A good one. Anything normal or below is getting deconstructed. Good. Excellent. Okay. Excellent bed is being installed here. Good. Normal. Superior. Okay. That'll work for me for right now, and then we'll make some more uh, to try to get even higher quality than this. Do any other folk have less than good? There's a normal bed there. Superior. Superior. Normal. So good at least. And then slowly but surely. Oh, the dresser? That was throwing me off. I thought it was trying to be built elsewhere. Normal. Any of these been taken down yet? No. Fine. Fine. Okay. Medical bed. Good. That needs to be done. Uh, do we want to remove these floors? Probably. It'll give us a little bit of steel, and we can do other things with those. And, um, hmm. Maybe we can speed up walking a little bit along this side. Since people garden here and stuff, that should work out all right. Something like this. Okay, perfect, perfect. I don't want to add too many because we're still not done. That's fine. See, Mitty walks down through here too, quite a bit. I feel like it's uh, probably ideal for us to get this going. Sure. There we go. Cool. Okay. Well, I think that's going to have to be it for this episode then. We are getting some progress made on the uh, walkways. A lot of these rooms are done now as far as the floors go. But we still do have quite a bit to go. Koth, build these walls please for 11. Alright. So if you want to catch the next one, I'm... Uh, yeah. Be sure to subscribe. Consider supporting my channel through the Patreon link down in the video description. And feel free to check out any of my other videos or playlists that you might be interested in. I thank you so much for all the time that you spend on my channel, and I hope blessings of wisdom and peace on all of you. Farewell.